I will show you guys a high impact version and a low impact version. I'm going to be doing the low impact version today because my no, back no. still hurts. So I'm going to show no. you a couple ways to do my emails on it. Or you can me with a lower impact, but cardio today, okay? So no weights needed, but we are going to do just a little warm up first before we get started. So we'll just start with some body weight squats, nice and easy. Just starting to get those legs a little bit warmed up. Oh, you're doing a squat? Up and down, up and down. All right, we're just, just going to take it out to a lateral lunge, and we're going to reach down for the opposite toe, just side to side here. And then we'll take it back to the squat. <sighs> nice job. About seven more seconds here on the squats. And then let's take it back out for that lateral lunge, toe touch out. Got seven seconds here. And then let's bring it up to a cross body kick. So we're standing, just raising one leg out to the side. And maybe start to twist that torso just a little. So the back arm is going to pull back just a little bit here. We're going to keep going with this for about 30 more seconds, and then we'll do our first Tabata. is a lateral lunge with a hop. So we're going to step out to the side, back together, hop. Uh, the way you can do this low impact is just a big step out to the side, together, squat, up to tiptoes. And then we'll take it to the other side, together, squat, tiptoes. And then we're going to do a boxer squat partnered with that, or paired with that. Okay, so 20 seconds, lateral lunge, here we go. So big step out, together squat jump or squat tiptoe. And rest, nice work. All right, boxer squat, feet are a little wider than hip width apart. We're going to get down nice and low, push up on one leg, and then recenter and go to the other side. So nice and low, all the weights over on that leg, and then over here. So you guys today might be a little lower impact, so feel free to throw in a weight if you want to keep that heart rate up real high. Rest. Right. 
All right, back to the lateral lunge. Top. Lateral lunge. Middle. Lateral lunge. Nice job. And rest. Good work. All right. <laughs> Bye, Amy. <laughs> Boxer squats, here we go. 10 more seconds. And rest. Okay, lateral lunge, big step out to the middle. Squat jump or up to tiptoes. Recover, nice job. Boxer squats, here we go. Get down low. Really push that booty back from the back of the room. Bending those knees lots. And rest. All right, final time through this set. Lateral lunge, hop. Get up every morning and do this with me, Mike. Huh? You get up every morning and do this with me. Join us. <laughs> <laughs> Rest. Nice work. All right, guys. Up next, we're going to do a burpee jack. So I'm going to show you the low impact version here. So I'm going to take it to a step back and then a step out and then back. You can also do that with a hop the whole time. So you're hopping down, hopping up, hopping at the top. Burpee jack first. Then we're doing a skier. You can do a big hop here. So you're leaping over side to side. You can take it to a step. Either option. I'll be doing the low impact. You guys take it high if you can. 20 seconds. Here we go. Burpee jack. Recover, nice work. All right, skiers, big hops or big steps, either way. Here we go. Nice job. All right, round two. Burpee Jack, let's go. Recover, nice job. 
Speed skaters or skiers. Down to the side. Here we go. Ten seconds. Burpee plank or burpee jacks. Recover. Nice work. Skiers, here we go. All right, last time through this set. Burpee jacks, here we go. Recover, and then our last speed skater or skier. Everybody, five more seconds. Cover. Great work. Okay, up next, we're going to do a push up shoulder tap. So I'm going to do these on my knees. I'm taking the shoulder tap out because my spine is twisting in a funny way. So we're going to push up, shoulder tap, push up, shoulder tap. If you feel good, go for it. You can be on your knees or your toes. And then we're gonna flip over to our back for a dead bug. So these are where we crunch up and then lay out. So let's get that camera down there. So we're here, crunching up, laying out. If you need a modifier, go for one leg at a time. If that still feels like a little too much, stay upright, crunch in, just go back as far as you can. Crunch in, because you'll feel your abs contract and keep you upright. Either way, you're going to get some ab work there. All right, guys. Push up, shoulder tap first. Here we go. Flip it over, dead bug crunches. Here we go. Nice job. Rest. Push-ups. Three, two, one. Here we go. And rest. Bug crunches. Good 
job. Three, two, one, rest. All right. Round three. Push ups. Here we go. Three seconds. Rest. Nice job. The bugs. Here we go. Rest. And then one last time through this set. Recover. Flip it over last time for dead bugs. Rest. Good work, everybody. All right, we're back on our feet for the next one. We're doing some standing ab work, which is going to look like on one side, you're springing that knee up. Now you can get your heart rate up a lot by putting a bounce in it. So you're keeping that standing leg nice and bent, quads working, putting a little hop in it. We'll go 30 or 20 on one side, 20 on the other, and we're in the middle with a squat jump at the end. So we'll, go, we'll do this round four times, but it's gonna be, it's gonna have a few more because we're doing both sides. All right, first side, 20 seconds, standing abs, here we go. whether or not you put the bounce in, you want to keep that knee nice and soft, a little bend in the leg, so quads and glutes are working there. You want to think about using those abs to bring that knee up each time. Rest. And then you want to find your breath here. That heart rate does go up with these. All right, here we go. Soft knee. High abs. Squat jump, low impact version, squat, tiptoe. Three, two, one, here we go. Down and up. One set down, three sets to go. Back to the standing abs. Here we go. Nice job, way to get after it guys. 10 more seconds. Good job. And rest, good. on the other side. 
Here we go. Five more seconds. Let's keep it going strong. Recover. Squat tiptoe or squat jump. Here we go. Down and up. Good job. One, rest. Here we go, two down, two to go. Standing abs, let's get them. Good job. Pulling it down, crunching up together. Recover. All right. Squat jump, squat tiptoe. Here we go. Cover. One final time through this set. Knee raise, crunch it up. Here we go. The other side. Three, two, one, here we go. You guys, keep it going. Ten seconds. And then our final squat jump or squat tiptoe. Here we go. And recover. Nice work. All right, moving on, final round. We're back on the floor for another ab set. We're doing some leg drops. So we're gonna be on our back. You can put your hands under your glutes if that helps. You just wanna make sure you're really protecting your lower back here. So leg drops here, and then bicycles. So we're here. If that gives you any problems, you can keep the knees bent and just go side to side that way. If you can, stick those legs all the way out. Those hip flexors are going to work too. It's probably the highest impact uh, or the highest heart rate workout we can do on the floor for our abs if you're doing it that way. All right, leg drops first. Here we go.
Nice job, everybody. Rest. Taking it to the bicycle now. Whatever version you can. If you can get those legs out, let's do it. Shoulder, or sorry, elbow to knee. Nice job. Keep it going five more seconds. Recover. All right, back to the leg drops. Here we go. Nice, slow, and controlled on the way down. Breathing. Rest. All right, let's get those bicycles in three, two, one, go. Five more seconds, keep it going, keep up the intensity. Rest, nice job. All right, two down, two to go. Leg drops. Rest. Bicycles, let's get them. Second. Rest, good job. All right guys, last time. Leg drops and bicycles one last time. Here we go. Good job. <laughs> Recover, and then let's get that last set of bicycles. Keep up the intensity as much as you can. It's our last 20 seconds. Here we go. Seven seconds. rest. All right. That's it for Tuesday, y'all. Nice work. Thanks. Have a great day. Thank you so much. Thanks for joining.